so I'll teach you how to do it. Thank you. Thank you. I am Tashana and I'm one of the brand ambassadors for Maple Leaf Hotel Restaurant. And we are about to learn how to use a chopstick. Firstly, you open it. And then... Yes, this shooting. Are we cutting it and shooting the feather? I think it will be more interesting. <laughs> okay. Start from there. So now we are shooting for the feather. Yeah. So now we are about to. I'm about to. What am I? Now uh, I'm about to eat, have a root bank with jampong. Which was, which is actually a Japanese Chinese word derived from the name champong, like C H 
A N P O M G, and it's it has shrimps, mussels, noodles, um, spring onions, chili pepper, chili um, oil, um, chili oil soup, onions, carrots, green pepper, and and we also have pickled radish and kimchi. And I'm using the chopsticks, but I'm about to try. So, Hashana, yeah. I remember that we, um, I met you genuinely. Yes, I can't. I can't. You, we met genuinely, right? Yes. And then you get to know our Maple Leaf Hotel or restaurant mm -hmm. as a customer. Mm -hmm. And then now we, you know that. We need a financial support to promote our restaurant and brand to the people who really love Korean culture. Now, at this day, you watching the uh, Hello Me, the Korean drama, and then now at this day, uh, people really like the Korean culture and drama. So that's why we get to know each other, and then now you are enjoying Korean for a lot. <laughs> You can eat, you can eat first. So I'm about to put you guys on this Korean series called Hello Me. It's, it's, it's a new Korean series. Okay, it's about, um, it's about this girl called Bahani, which um, is 37 years old. And her past, her little self, which is about 13, came to visit her, like mistakenly I guess came to her in her future life and this made them like get together and fix things and like talk about yeah like she wasn't able to tell people that oh this is my past self so she told people it's her um, daughter and but her mother found out and her sister also found out So, and um, Bahani has two men which are madly in love with her. So, I think from the episodes that are coming, she's supposed to choose one, one man to be with, obviously. And also, um, her past self is in trouble because she can't like leave the the her like the dimension she's in because she's in very big trouble and people are like coming after her and coming her and now uh, they want to kill her i think evil spirits or something like that want to kill her so she needs to carry this um you know those korean cards where they go to the uh what are they called and we call it Buja. yes she has to keep that wherever she goes and yeah so i'm not going to spoil it for you so you should watch hello me it's a very nice Korean show. But I want to discuss, uh, talk about the Hello Me together. Okay. It, like, you, I want to uh, break down the, uh, the episode one, two, three, maybe later, you know, when you shoot, then we talk about the Hello Me together, okay? Like how we talk about Alice and uh, the, the key tournament will we'll do with another Korean ambassador or, you know, we have a plenty of Korean series where you're supposed to, like, um, break down the scene, then we review them, maybe you can try with us about Hello Me. So I should talk about the first But episode. not now, but you have to eat first, <laughs> then, then we'll talk about episode one, two, three, later, okay? Because we need to make script, you know? Well, you talk. I just saw the episode one. First part of it, it looks very interesting. Then I know the how the Chagang is a very famous the Korean the female 
actress, you know. She most uh, she uh, acting in Korea almost 20 years, you know. She's very famous. The the man, the woman, the actress. I know, I know her. You know. Uh, no, no, after we eat, okay. <laughs> so you video me eating? Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm just asking, why you like Zampo? Mm. Zampo is very good. I like the fact that there are so many varieties of meats and the shrimps and everything. There's everything, literally. And the soup is actually very close to the lights we have. So it's very good. And that's my favorite. So I'm telling you that um, when I started school, I, I need like jajangmyeon, black bean noodles, okay? When I was a kid. But I couldn't eat jampu. Why? Because <laughs> I didn't like jampu, you know. Because when I was a kid, it's kind of kind of adult food, you know, it's not for kids. When I when I tried this one, when I was like 10 years old, you know, when I started school, like I'm 39, almost 29 years ago. But when I was 15 or 16, I, I started like the tempo. But I like this kind of spice means. And then I like the chili oil, you know. The inside the, the sauce, the chili oil is very nice. And the seafood also is very nice. But when you eat this one with the uh, radish pickle, it's very nice. I thought you were using the uh, chopstick. No. Not the chopstick. <laughs> to make me go slow because I just started learning. Uh. Today food is okay? Yeah, it's good. Guys, it's very, very good. You should try it. You'd love it. I feel like we are shooting the tour, yeah, it's slowly, right? <laughs> The reason I talk about the, uh, I didn't like the champong when I was a kid, but I'm surprised that you like the champong, you know? Yeah. yeah the, the thing you first order is a uh, champong, and then you always order champong, remember? Because it's very good, the champong. You know that in Ghana, they don't sell champong from our hotel, our restaurant. But I always complain because I stay in Ghana almost eight years. I'm looking for the champo in jajang, especially jajang, I really want to eat. And tang si also. But well, I couldn't find it, you know. <laughs> That's why I, I ask my family to make it, why don't you make it, and then they agree. Then. That's why I hold them with champo like this. But when they make it like this, I was very surprised. And the taste is almost like the, the champo in Korea. Yeah. Jump on Korean taste just like this. Yeah, yeah, just like that. And then we put more seafood over there. Especially squid is very uh, big squid. As you can see, 
can see the squid over here. Um, Tema. Yeah, I went to Habo and I get the um, squid. I'm sure you can eat all, right? I want to ask you some very important question. Uh, why do you like our friend, the Philip restaurant? Why do you like our friend, like Maple Leaf Hotel, Maple Leaf restaurant? Why do you like it? Because it's very unique. There are not so many. Like, I don't know of any other Korean restaurants apart from here. And you're a very nice person. Thank you. You're, you're very cool and respectful and humble, which makes the brand of the place very attractive. You're also very nice and humble. Pardon? You're also very nice and humble person. Thank you. <laughs> we work together. You know. Thank you so much. Do you know that when you watch Korean drama, we always bow down, you know, that. so we really respect the, uh, the elderly people, you know, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. And we always put the yo. And we can talk about Korean language also. Like that one is it's very nice culture. You know, when when the when I was a kid, okay, mm -hmm. I was scared. You know why? Because of our education is kind of very strict. Mm -hmm. I like this that shrimp. I'm very hungry. Why is there some? And. I was scary, you know, I'm telling you, because when I was a kid, because I'm Korean, and then when I go to school, the way the teacher teach you and very um, strict, because of the discipline, you know what I'm mm -hmm. uh, I think that the, the reason why they so strict when you teach the kid, and I realized that when I become the uh, elderly person, like uh, 20 or 25, 30, then it's kind of discipline. You, know. you cannot get discipline easily, you know. It's like self-control and especially respect, you know. Yeah. Then that was it's, it's kind of the pity of the uh, uh, the life, you know. So nobody can get the discipline easily. So that's why I love the Korean culture because I've been to another country and I'm in Ghana. In Ghana also. We have a similar con uh, culture, like respect the elderly people, like very calm when you talk with the other people. You also part of Ghana, you understand, isn't it? Yeah. Because your mommy teach you how to Ghana culture is. It's kind of the, it's very nice yeah, when you respect other people. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they, it influences good thing to other people, and then yeah, it's very nice. And to make those elder, elderly people respect you too. Yeah. So it wouldn't be difficult to ask them for stuff yeah. and talk to them and communicate with them. You know that the, it's part of Korean culture. Mm -hmm. Just as joking. When you eat food, you have to invite your elderly person first, right? Mm -hmm. I'm elderly person. You didn't invite the food. <laughs> oh, you invited! <laughs> no, it's okay. I'm shooting. I'm walking. Very grateful about the shooting that because of you chose our brand and then we didn't need you like promote our friend and then any without any condition and just I can see the fashion you know like sometimes when customer come you know they they are all like 
the uh, the the Korean culture, Korean drama first. Imino, you know, you know Imino. Imino is a the kingdom of monarch, and then voice of Korao. And the Kenyan is the little creature about the Imino and BTS also. BTS army. They you know BTS like for song and dynamite. You know, most of our customers they really love Korean culture. That's why they are here. But mm -hmm. almost 90 percent, maybe you guys can see our Instagram. Maybe I'll, I'll put a caption about our Instagram page. You guys can check our Instagram page. There the are link. yeah, I will, yeah, I'll show the link. Yeah. And then the Instagram.com New Maple Leaf Hotel. You guys can go there and check it. You guys can see a lot of. The customer photo. They and you see the photos. They really love the Korea culture and the food and vibe here. And then that one is very impressive. You know. You are full. Huh? You see, you can like you, you, you see you can eat all and uh, you are full. Wow. You need time to take a rest. Is very much, very, very much. Do you? I've eaten from this side and I still not finish it. So I'm going to put something in here. <laughs> I never finish. Don't push yourself, you, you, you get sick, isn't it? Yeah. But I never had the jumping make someone sick. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't it? Hmm. Today I have to jump on today. Pardon? Today I always jump on today. Mm -hmm. Okay, you guys, I'm going to give you a review. So, as you can see, I'm not done. The food is too much. It's just so much. And the prices are not even high at all. So, it was very good. Like anytime I come here, I just order jumbo because, like, for me, to me, in my opinion, that's the best. But your food is really good, but that's the one I love. So, hi, once again, I'm Tisha and I'm from my Central Beauty Hotel Restaurant. And welcome to Big Food Hotel. Subscribe? Click the link to subscribe and hit the bell notification to be notified whenever we post and, and click the thumbs up to like our video. Thank you. Share the video also, right? And share the video too. Thank you. You're supposed to say Korean language, what is it? Asamu. Annyeong. Annyeong. Say annyeong. Annyeong. Say annyeong.